You watch your girl, boo, see. Who do you see? What's up, boys? Well, welcome back to another video. It's your girl, Boosie Boo. Today's video will be about leader, leadership, whatever you want to call it. So let's get it right into it. Psalms 37, 3-4. Trust in the Lord and do good. Dwell in the land and enjoy safe pasture. Take delight in the Lord, and he will give you the desires in your heart. The only person that can guide you in life is God. Can nobody else in the world guide you like he can? Because he's going to guide you to the right path. The other one's just going to take you to where you want to be. But you need to go where you need to be. Here's a quote. Great leaders don't set out to be a leader. They set out to make a difference. It's never about the role. It's always about the goal. When you become a leader, you take roles into humanity. You grow as a person and you allow others to grow with you. You take into consideration that... The lives of others matter just like yours. Martin Luther King Jr. once said, take the first step in faith. You don't have to see the whole staircase, just take the first step. You want to know when you're taking the right step is when you're taking that step and you have no worries in the world. When you know that you don't have no worries, that's God putting his arms around you and guiding you in the path. Every path that you take, as long as God by your side, you're going the right way. You cannot reach greatness if you do not continue to try. Because as long as you keep trying and trying and trying and trying, don't give up. You're one step ahead and you're one step closer to where you need to be. We live in an era now to where you need to help yourself. If you want others to help you, you got to show them that you're willing to help yourself first. And once they see that, they are willing to help you all, by all means. But you got to help yourself first. Imagine being that person that doesn't want to build but want others to grow around them. It ain't going to work like that. You can't expect people to grow around you when you're not trying to be. James 4.10 Humble yourselves before the Lord and he will lift you. If you're not willing to break that chain that's stopping you from greatness, then you're not willing to grow. The only leader that you need in life is God. God should be your only leader because he knows what's going on and he knows how to fix it and change it. Without God, nothing is possible. So when his time matches perfectly with your position, you will always win. You will always make greatness as long as you got God. You never become a leader if you have hatred in your heart. Leadership doesn't make hatred. Hatred makes leadership. And what I mean by that is, when you become a leader, automatically people think you're better than them when you're not. You just become the leader to help change them. Everybody in life is not going to agree with everything you do. But it's okay to have opinions sometimes. But don't let the opinions get to you. 2 Timothy 2.15 Do your best to present yourself to God as one approved, a worker who does not need to be ashamed and who correctly handles the word of truth. James 4.10 Humble yourselves before the Lord and he will lift you up. 